I mean, it's just a shoot around, but just uh, having another veteran, um, another another leader, um, it, it helps for our young guys. You know, that's for sure. And then, um, you know, it gives us a. We're pretty good in the front court now, you know, with uh, uh, with Javale, Tyson, Big Zoo. Uh, you know, we're, we're looking uh, pretty good, so it's good for us. Um, I mean, it helps. I mean, for sure. You know, we get, we have a lot of experience, and uh, we've been through everything. We've been through, you know, losing in the playoffs. We've been through winning it all. Um, you know, so uh, we, we've seen it all, uh, from adversity to the good times to the bad times, or if you, if you want to say such. So uh, we can give them those experiences. But, you know, them playing, they have, like I always say, that that's going to be the best teacher, but we can definitely we can school them some. Uh, I think one thing about a veteran, they, they, they're quick learners, they've been around, uh, systems are all pretty much the same with different terminology, so he, he, him being able to pick up what we're doing already, um, you know, it's, it's pretty good. What are your strongest memories of him over, over, the, over your career? Is it Team USA, the finals? Where, where Team you guys USA, uh, playing against him in the finals, um, watching him when he was in high school at Dominguez, uh, so I go all the way back there, so uh, I've been watching uh, TC for, 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 for quite a while. You talked a lot about the importance of communication. How much more important is it when it's coming from the center position? Um, I think, it's, yeah, I mean, that's, that's huge. You know, when it's coming from the center position, but uh, just the back line, because the front line, as far as the point guards, they're on the ball, so they can't see what's going on behind them. So, you know, if the center is communicating, um, you know, if the, um, you know, the guards and the forwards behind them is communicating, it, it helps out a lot. Uh, it all depends who are who, who's the captains. Um, I think obviously you have certain personalities that uh, can add to it, um, but it all depends how much the captains are going to get into it as far as their draft board. So um, we'll see. I did it last year, so I'm glad I don't have to do it again. Did, did you overall did you like the, that format last year? Yeah, it was great. Uh, me and Steph, we had a. I mean, we had a great time drafting, um, you know, on the phone, just picking one another. It was fantasy basketball for us, and, um, you know, it was fun. Is televising it give it a, a, a better dynamic, a bad dynamic? I mean, What's bad about it? It's All-Star Weekend. You've got 24 of the best players in the world. That's going to make the team. It doesn't matter if you're first or last. You're 24 of the best in the world at that point in time. So, yeah, I don't think it could be bad. But we'll see. <laughs>